Geoptic First Solution based on uh, real-time location systems. Tell me a little bit about how that system works. Yeah, so the system is, is driven off of badges that emit IR and RF signals that are picked up by sensors in the clinic. So every team member or every provider that's working in, in the clinic, as well as any patient that has an appointment, receives a badge upon entry of the, into the building. That, those badges are what the system uses to sense the location, the location of our patients and team members. And what's really unique about this system is it's real time. So we can actually see where the patient is and what's part of their visit there is based on the sequence of events of badges going in and out of certain locations. So for example, when a patient enters into the clinic at the time of registration, the badge is assigned during, our, during the registration component of the visit uh, through our EHR. At that moment, the badge is picked up through the system and it follows the patient until they leave the clinic and their visit is over. So once the patient enters an exam room, that creates a color change on our monitors that our team members can see, letting them know the patient's arrived at their exam room and it's, they're ready for their first step of the visit. Depending on which specialty they're there to see, whether it's family practice or a different specialty, that then triggers notification mechanisms within the software that are displayed on large monitors in our common, our common team areas that every team member is able to see. So if the patient needs to be done to do the visit prep, uh, the MA enters the room. And after the MA may leave the room, then it's the provider notification that, that gets teed up. All of this I, I like to think about is our 2020 version of a door flag. So the old office clinics with the door flags on the door, or in, in, as we moved into electronic health records, maybe different colored dots that are used to indicate whose turn it is next, is all driven through the system in a very passive way. So there isn't a requirement for the team member or provider or patient, for, uh, for example, to go in and do anything. It's all based off of a workflow that's built off of a sequence of events that triggers what needs to happen next.